Even when you feel low, you can still go Even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never answer to no man, I still go, go. Welcome back to our channel, Bertie Bird. The one and only YouTube channel Yay, here we are at our second home Scarborough Almer Al Al Alpermer car park so we parked here uh, and it's just to take dogs on beach in Scarborough for the first time. It not be today because it's a bit late, isn't it? So we're just letting them have run ramp car park and we'll, they will be on the beach tomorrow. So uh, stay tuned in this vlog and we'll film them on the beach for the very first time. Oh, wow. This is the first time that uh, what, what we're calling him, Bertie or Ozzy, is running around the car park with these two. So uh, he's not really that interested in ball, is he at the moment? No, he likes this little toy though. Oh, yeah. What you got? Well, yeah, it really looks like he likes that day. <laughs> I can see. No, can't do that for us. Filled up with water at uh, Morrison's garage as you come into Scarborough where we always go to fill up with water and uh, so we're good, we're good for a few days I think aren't we Zoe? Yeah, yeah. So we might have a few days here because I love it here. And uh, we've been into a pet's home and we've got uh, Oz a, uh, a new lead. A new Enjoy lead? Me, Whoa! Yeah, we started to notice a bit of a change. Millie and Bodie again, a little bit more acceptance of him. And uh, they don't seem to mind him as much now, which is a good thing. And I think getting him out playing like this, like they are running around together, it's going to help a lot. So that's why we've come here, guys. Uh, a few days on beach. Let them play together. Let them get used to working together. And uh, yeah, it's nice to watch. He's a very good off lead. I think it's going to be uh, really good. You want some chicken? Hmm? You want some chicken, Millie? Have some chicken. Right, who's going first? Sit, Millie. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Here we go. A little bit for Millie. A little push my fingers and booty. Bruce! Bruce! Put your mind up, you Sit! Can. Bruce! You're Bruce! 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 Yeah? Oh, chicken! He doesn't snatch. He's right gentle. Yeah, not like these two. Morning, Monday morning, and let me show you where we are. See if you can guess. <laughs> So I'm just going to uh, run around coast in Scarborough. I love it here. It's uh, one of my favourite runs. Just running all, all along the coast. <laughs> Absolutely love it. Castle up there. It's uh, quite mild today, about 12 degrees. Uh, I think it's forecast a bit of rain though. I think these two are glad to escape for a little bit away from Bruce. Keeps jumping up all over him. <laughs> but they keep telling him they're putting him in his place. We'll soon work it out, but I don't think they're uh, getting on too badly, to be honest. That's a nice little cafe. You take dogs on beach and we go in there before we've got a coffee. I do like this statue. Old guy. So on bench we walk in safe. I'm not sure where it's supposed to be. Let's have a look. 
Is it supposed to be Freddie Gilroy? Well, I'll have to read that and see who he was. The last time we were on here to see he was, it was actually two weeks ago, um, when we were in France. Two weeks, that was the thing. Motorhome's just parked there. It's free in this time of year to park there. Uh, I know, is it April or May or March? I'm not sure. I'd have to check the sign out. No, I think it is actually March, as I can remember last time. But it's a bit noisy though. It's a good spot on ACC, but it's very noisy from traffic. It's a lovely here. Even though it is raining, I don't care. My motor home's part there. And I just want to show you something here across the road in that building. It's a free service point for motor homes. You can empty your toilet cassette and fill up with water. How good is that? There's not many places in the UK, is there? Free places like that. Oh, in fact, places at all where you can pay. You know what? I'm being fancy in what I am dad. My mum's ever since before we, we went to uh, France. Fish and chips. Oh, I'll fancy them for me to you later. Can't be fish and chips at the seaside, can you? Oh, it's so lovely. Scabra! On his way back now, just been into Scarborough. Um, when I uh, checked the halfway mark, I took two and a half miles, so two and a half miles back. So that's just five miles done today, doggies. I want to get my steps in because we a new puppy. We're not going to be able to walk as far. Uh, mind you, just keep me busy. <laughs> He's really starting to come out of his shell now. He was biting me hair, humping me leg, getting out pool bags and ripping them to shreds. I were a little bugger this morning. <laughs> oh no, roll out for a walk down to the beach, aren't we? Yes, Bud is excited. Bruce doesn't know what he's doing. Bruce thinks you've got treats. This way. This way, come on. He thinks you've got treats in your bag. He's very food orientated. <laughs> oh, it's first time on a beach. Oh. William Bodhi no. Not that way. Ooh. Come on then. Come on. What's this? What is it? Whoa, what's this? What's this? That's one. There's two. You gonna let him off? Yeah, Off they go. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Hiya. Right. Uh... <laughs> oh. Come, Bruce. 
Oh, what do you think to this? Really knows, don't you, Millie? What do you think? Hey, do you like it? <laughs> I can't keep up with him. <laughs> Go on then, Millie, get the ball. Drop the ball. Good boy. You're leaving it, Millie. Leave the ball. Come on in. Oh, he's straight in. <laughs> straight in. Come on then. <laughs> oh, you're straight in there, aren't you? <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Love it. He's not bothered. <laughs> See if you'll do it again. You ready? You ready? <laughs> it's first time in sea. <laughs> you show him, Millie. Yeah. <laughs> Oh bless him. Ready? You ready Bruce? You ready? Is he gonna go for it again? <laughs> he loves it! <laughs> Did you like that? Well, have you become alpha dogness? Because you've got bloody trees, that's why. Because when we got the treats, is that what it is? We're ready. We're ready. Ready. <laughs> yeah, I know, Millie. I think you'll take to beach life really well, don't you? Yeah. You get used to this. This is what we do. This is what we do. Is that not a bad thing to start off with? Might not be a bad thing to start off with. Yeah. Leave them two to play, won't it? And he just runs around. Yeah. <laughs> Come on then. Come on. Ready? Touch it! <laughs> you ready? <laughs> Come on then! He's not wandering off, is he? Hello. <laughs> staying with us, isn't he? Yeah, he's staying near me. He's a good well. boy, aren't you? He's staying next to me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Look at smile on your face. Look at that. Look at smile on your face. <laughs> you love it, don't you? Yeah. Thanks, I'm the alpha male. <laughs> <laughs> you need to talk in a deeper voice, love. That's what you need to do. Yeah. <laughs> Why you don't? <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> Look how he walks with you. Well, I've lost him then. No, he's right by your feet, love. Having a great time, aren't you? Come on then. Don't want to tie him out too much. No. It's only a puppy. Eh? Yeah. You can't walk too far yet, yeah. Bruce. Can he? Where's our two? Hello? 
in a body herding up there. They're doing their own thing. I think he's tired, isn't he? Stop running with him. Yeah, yeah. him out. Mm. I think he's had a good time. Mm. Can we go to the pub now? Sorry. Yeah. Where's my bun? You didn't ask for a bun. I always have a bun. No, you don't. I do. No, you, if you want a bun, you should ask for one. You always get me a bun. I don't. You do. No. Zoe, the only time I don't get a bun is when you don't bring me one. I always have a bun. Well, go and get one then now. Can't What's believe that? you've not got me a bun. Oh. What's that? Enough, Vicky. I don't like that. Whoa, well, no, 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 no. If I'd have gone, I'd have picked a better one. God, never happy. Listen, it's like bloody Battersea let dogs home out here. Let him get go. off, get off. I've got him, John. Like you got me, love. <laughs> Be a lead around my neck. <laughs> we like, um, you know, them people that get paid to take dogs for a walk because they've got that many dogs, Zoe. People will be thinking that that's what we're doing. We're dog walkers. Yeah, because we've got that many of them now. He's doing really well, though, isn't he, for walking? Yeah, pick him up on way back. Yeah. But he's doing really well, isn't he? Can't take him too far because he's a puppy, but. Yeah. They're loving it. Isn't you guys? All going for a walk together. Have you seen how he walks? Yeah. Like he's a show dog. He is a show dog, love. And they're all starting to get on a little bit better. Aren't they? Yeah. Him and Bodhi seem to be gelling quite a lot at the moment, don't they? Yeah. It's getting a lot better with each other. They've stopped biting each other now, which is always good. <laughs> you happy now, love? Yeah, our vision trips. Ain't it did it for about four months? Whoa, no way. Yeah, vision trips at seaside, I would say. <laughs> Look at Bruce, so he's very confident, isn't he? He just struts his stuff, doesn't he? At the side of you. He's happy. Just strutting about. So, Zoe, have we thought of a name? Yeah, Bruce. Are oh, we going to Bruce now? Bruce. I thought he was called Ozzy. In response to Bruce. What about Ozzy? No, definitely Bruce. Shut up, he's Bruce. Are you sure about yeah, that? Yeah, I am sure, 100%. Well, I'm calling him Bruce, you'll call him what you want. I'll call him Ozzy. Call him Ozzy? But he likes me more, so he'll respond to Bruce. Somebody has two babes, I suppose. I don't care, as long as my three dogs like, I don't care about anybody else. What? <laughs> as long as what? As long as we three dogs on me, I don't care about anybody else. Bloody hell. So, we've been doing a trial with him, haven't we? And we've called him Bruce, and we've also called him Ozzy. And we keep changing his name, he's getting a little bit confused. But we're trying to work out what name does he respond to best. And he seems to have picked his own name, doesn't he? Yeah. Because every time we've called him Ozzy, he ignores us. When we call him Bruce, he comes back to us. So he seems to like Bruce. No, it's because it's me that calls him Bruce, so he always comes back to me. What? It's because I call him Bruce, that's why he responds to Bruce, because it's always me shouting Bruce. Is that why you get no response from me then, because you don't call me Bruce? <laughs> right? Is that what you're saying? I said I'm call you Bruce one, two. Bruce, Bruce what? One. <laughs> Bruce one, two. I don't know. <laughs> I'm a bit drunk. <laughs> In my opinion, you know when you've got two real dogs, I, I just think it's better to 
let one of them uh, dominate. If you have two similar, well, they clash and we'll just start fighting. So I always think. Is that why you let me dominate you, sir? I actually quite like it a little bit. Whoa, moving on from that. <laughs> Yeah, the, uh, the the dog pack has changed and the pecking order has now completely changed. Everything's been rearranged and they've done this amongst themselves. So, and I don't think that Bruce is kind of really happy. He's quite a happy dog, isn't he? He's quite yeah. dropped in. He knows his, now knows his place. And he's a happy little dog, isn't he? Trotting behind Bode. So, it's been a, a very uh, interesting day with our dogs. And we've watched them as to what's happening in the pack and things have changed quite a lot so Bodie has become lead dog so when we're out for a walk Bodie's become the lead dog and what I mean by that is Bodie is not happy unless he's out in front Millie's now dropped behind Bodie and Millie has kind of given up the lead dog to Bodie. Now, whether that's because Millie knows she's just, you know what I mean, getting tired. And Bruce, we keep behind. And we do that for Bodie's sake because Bodie's taken it upon himself that he is now in charge of the pack. And We've noticed with him is now more like acceptance of Bruce. And when we are out walking, what Bodie now does is he keeps checking both sides. So he'll, he'll go up to and check Millie. He, he and judges Bruce, doesn't he? He judges him. Yeah. So, so what Bodie's doing now is he, he not only does he check on Millie, he's actually turning around and coming back to Bruce to nudge him to make sure he's all right then looks at us and then goes back to lead dog again he's like looking after the pack if you know what i mean he's taking it upon himself and we're going to let him do that aren't we because yeah, he is going to be the lead dog at some yeah. point isn't he, as we know millie has definitely yeah. dropped back now and millie is kind of a bit indifferent i think now um she's an old lady and she's she's she's, she's um she don't care so i definitely think the the uh, stronger dog which is obviously now birdie we're going to allow him to be the lead dog. And uh, something else I want to mention. Something else, more, more things. Yeah, um, he sleeps all the way through night. He don't get as up the same night. Oh, you're talking about dog? <laughs> okay. <well. laughs> no, he don't get up until about seven, eight o'clock. So as soon as he gets up, I lift him outside to do his business. Well, uh, yeah, for good night's sleep, I can remember Bodie being a puppy and I felt like I'd got a newborn baby because he always used to keep me up all night. But no, Rose is just more settled, I think. So, we are in the Tunny Catch, aren't we? It's quite a nice pub, this actually. It's like a um, Brewer's Fair with food, isn't it? It is nice in here. It's a Marston's pub. And it's part of the car park where we're parked uh, for Alpa Mare. So, uh, yeah, it's a look, and not bad the price either, is it really? So, I've right, only stayed for a couple of drinks and we'll have uh, seen do some editing. So, we've decided on Whoa. his name. Whoa, have we? Yeah. Who's telling me that we've decided on his name? Yeah, we've, we've decided on his name. Ozzy. Bruce. Ozzy? No, it's Bruce. Oh, he, he, he responds to Bruce more. I like Doyle. Do, don't Birdie take... and Doyle. No, decisions made. Professionals. It's, it's... Birdie and Doyle, I like that. No, Bruce. Sorry. Decisions being made. Who's made decision like? Bruce. Was it? Mm. Bruce has made the decision. He, he said he likes that name. Mm -hmm. We've been calling them both names all day, haven't we? No, Ozzy no, and Bruce. What a dog. No. He does seem to answer to Bruce, I don't know why. He does. <laughs> so Bruce it is. Seems to have decided on it, doesn't he? Yeah. He really likes that name, he does as he's told. <laughs> 
I hope you've enjoyed this vlog, guys. It's first time on the beach with Bruce. So, um, it's been good today, hasn't it? Yeah. I'm tired now, but really, really enjoyed it, haven't we? Mm. And we had a little drinking pub to celebrate, only to socialise Bruce. Do you know what I mean? It is There is a reason for this, <laughs> that we're just trying to get him socialised with people. So, I think it's a really good idea at the moment to keep yeah, taking him in pubs. Socialize to to, to socialise him with people and pubs and let no, him become a pub dog like, us, like Millie and Birdie are. In a cafe? No, it's not the same, is it? You don't get fussed in a cafe. He doesn't. Not the same as the way he gets fussed in a pub. Do you know what I mean? Look at that little girl earlier poking him with a stick. See, that's socialising. Yeah, she really took a liking to it, <laughs> oh, didn't God, she? Oh, God, get rid of her, could we? <laughs> <laughs> Buddy. Buddy and Millie and Bruce got a bit fed up in the end, didn't they? Yeah. And they all went under the table to get away from her. God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, uh, Bruce, it is then, darling. Yeah. So, uh, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. And uh, we're back, aren't we, love? Mm, we are. We are back. We've got uh, Bertie booked in uh, to have work done in him mm. on Tuesday, haven't we? Uh, a week today, yeah. A week today is booked in at Garage Guys. So, uh, hopefully we'll get to the bottom of this warning light coming on and we're having the engine serviced and we're going to talk about having the chip reverse and all that type of thing. So, uh, we will take it in on Tuesday and uh, talk to him about it. He's booked in anyway, and we'll take it from there. So hopefully we'll get to the bottom of all these problems, yeah. fingers crossed. He has mm. been all right since we've come into the UK, to be fair. Ain't he? But he yeah. needs sorting out, doesn't it? So Definitely, yeah. Oh, we will. We'll sort that out. So um, onwards and upwards tomorrow. So um, <laughs> I'm tired. It's like having a newborn baby, isn't it? Me, yeah, but every him. time you get out of bed, Zoe, it wakes me up. Know what I mean? Oh, it's Can you not do any bit quieter? Well, I'll tell you what, you go out of bed. What? Anyway, he sleeps through. Don't he? He don't have to go up out of bed. Why was he tired then? <sighs> Bloody hard work, this parenting lark. It's me on. what gets up. I don't sit in the alarm clock anymore. I just use Bruce. He gets me up. When he gets up, I get What's up. between your toes? What's that? Oh, it's a bit of fluff off my sock. So you're going gross. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> distracting me that I don't like feet. So uh, we'll catch you guys later. Yeah. On our next vlog, hopefully, whatever that will be. So, uh, catch you guys later. Bye. Bye.